Hi, welcome back. In this video, I will discuss how to write a Lex program to count the number of lines, words, spaces and characters in a given statement. So in this case, we need to ask user to enter the given input statement. And then we need to count the number of lines, words, spaces and characters in the given input. And then we need to display it. We know that uh, any Lex program contains uh, three sections. The first section starts with the percentage followed by the curly brace and then it ends with the percentage followed by opening closing the curly brace. This section is called as the uh, definition section. Here uh, we will try to add all the header files. In this case we need one header file that is a hash include stdio.h Along with this, we, if you want to add some variables, uh, we can create those particular variables here. In this case, I need four variables. One is uh, LC, which will indicate the number of uh, lines are zero. Second one is SC is equal to zero. That is nothing but the number of spaces are zero. WC is equal to zero. That is nothing but the number of words are zero. CC is equal to zero indicates the characters are zero till now. Next, we will start with the rule section which will start with the two percentage symbol and then it ends with the two percentage symbols here. Here we will try to write the rules to match with the line words, spaces and characters here. So if we come across a new line, the meaning of this one is it is a line. So in the action part, we will increment LC by one that is LC plus plus. Along with that, we will increment CC by uh, YYLENG that is nothing but the length of matched content in this case. Similarly, we need to uh, count the number of uh, spaces that is nothing but space or a tab. It is nothing but uh, a space here. So what we do is uh, in the action part, we will increment SC by one and then the character count will be incremented by YYLENG that is the matched content again here. The third one is to match with uh, words here. So uh, how to match with a word? That's a question over here. So unless and until we come across a space or a tab in between or a new line, everything is a word in this case. So this Lex is a one word. Again, it, if we start matching with this particular program till this particular space, it is another word over here. So because of that, we will add a title symbol here. Unless and until we come across a tab or a new line or a space, it may be one or spa more spaces, one or more tab or one or more new line. Uh, that is nothing but one word in this case. So that's the reason we will add a plus here. And then uh, we will write WC plus plus that is nothing but we will increment the word by one in this case and the character count will be incremented by YYLENG that is the length of matched content over here. So these are the three rules are required and then uh, we will come across the third section that is nothing but the user subroutine section. So we will write int main and then we will ask user to enter the input. So enter the input so user will enter the input once that user enters the input that input will be sent to the rule section with the help of yy lex here once entire input is consumed we need to print the result that is a uh, number of you can say that uh, uh, words are we can say percentage D followed by a new line in this case and then comma WC here that is the number of words are WC and then the second one is uh, the number of uh, we can say uh, characters that is nothing but uh, CC and then third one is a uh, number of you uh, can say that uh, new lines that is nothing but uh, LC and finally the number of spaces that is nothing but SC here and finally uh, we need to write the last function that is uh, int yy wrap here this is to indicate the end of your input here we write one statement that is written one in this case so this is a very simple program uh, where uh, we can count the number of lines, words, spaces and characters over here. Now we will go to the terminal and then we will see whether our program is working fine or not. Uh, first we need to compile our Lex program with the help of Lex compiler. Lex 
that is count.l is the name of the program here uh, we will get uh, yy dot uh, lex.yy.c that is uh, the c file after compiling with the help of uh, lex compiler we need to compile uh, this uh, lex.yy.c with the help of uh, gcc we will get an output file that is a dot out we will execute that a dot out with the help of uh, dot slash uh, in this case uh, it is asking us to enter the input i will enter the input here uh, once i enter this particular input I will press Ctrl D, which indicates the end of input in this case. Now we can see here, uh, in this case we have four words, that is Mahesh, Uddar, KR and IND. The number of characters, if you count here, 6633, three, that is 18. This one is 19, 20, two new line characters, that is 21 and 22, so that is perfectly fine. Two spaces are there and then two lines are there. So that is what has been printed over here. So in this program, uh, what I did is, uh, I have explained you how to write a Lex program to count the number of lines, words, spaces and characters. It's a very simple program. If you like the video, do like and uh, share with your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.